Minute Maid Park has played host to some outstanding baseball this weekend. And tonight, we wrap up the Shriners Children's College Classic with a classic matchup. How about Texas A&M taking on Texas Tech? It's been a good decision. He has uh, really developed into more of a complete pitcher. So right to second base in the force at second is out. A good defensive play by the Aggies. Ryan Targosh over there with a nice stop in the first play at second. Yeah, outstanding. This pitch. The one-two delivery. Swung on and missed. So Cortez works himself out of a jam with a strikeout to end the inning. High heat. Cortez. This game remains tied. This one slaps hard and a great stop at second base by Ryan. Man, this is second big stop in the game as he goes to first base for the out. <laughs> he is throwing some leather. That is a major league player out there. That ball was scorched off the bat of Gage Harrelson. What a stop. That Targosh. So Carter has pushed it all the way forward. And it's What a job by Chris Cortez. Working out of another jam and he finishes off with a huge strikeout. 69th pitch of the night for Cortez who gets the Aggies out of a jam. This game will remain tied. He is starting to heat up for the Aggies. Brandon Beckel delivered. Hit on the ground. By the shortstop. It's a base hit. And it's a 1-0 game. The Aggies go out in front. Great job by Austin Bose. He changed the game in that Base runner breaks on the play. Ball is to short and have one play. That is to first base, and Harrison is out. So a good job by the Red Raiders to start the runner and avoid the double play. Swing and a miss. Down low, he left the third at the first base to get him, but what a job by Will Johnson. Play hard here, try to elevate a bit. So Johnston delivers on 0-2, and it's a swing and a miss, and he got the strikeout. How about Will Johnston? Yeah, electric arm, he has been dynamic. The delivery. Ball four, and he walked in the tying run. So Damian Bravo with the bases loaded. Walks in the tying run. Gage Harrison tries to bump, but he gets it up, and it's caught. A nice play by the third baseman, Trevor Warner. Does a great job coming down the line. So the first offering to Cash, lifted into the air, and is going to be caught in center field. And we are going to go into extra innings as the Aggies work out of a major jam with the bases loaded. This one is hit on the ground. It goes to the shortstop. He goes over to second base, does Haas, and that takes us out of the inning. So guess what, Pat? We're on our way to the 11th. Good long look at first. Comes to the plate with it and is hit. High into the air, but deep into left field and back. And a nice catch on the play over there by the left fielder. Wow. That is Kent, Caden Kent. Good battle here between Austin Beck and Hudson White. The one-two pitch. Swing and a miss. And a strikeout by Ashen Beck. Oh, caught him looking. What a pitch by Evan Ashen Beck. And half his teammates come out on the field to greet him. So the count goes full to Hudson White. White swings and he misses. A strikeout for Evan Oshinbeck. I think Bobby Dynamite has went home, or is he still up there in that train? <laughs> I, I haven't seen him in a while. He went home. That's a strikeout. Strike three called <laughs> on Hester. Get out the side. My goodness. Get through this infield or get a ball deep to the outfield. One and one offering goes to short, and he can't handle it as Lopez. It goes off of Lopez, and Bard comes in to score. That's going to be an error on Lopez. And Haas goes all the way to third. 
Justin Lampkin rocks and delivers, and it's a swing and a miss, and the ball game is over. And Texas A&M came from behind to knock off Texas Tech, your final score, 4-2 here at Minute Maid Park tonight.